in Temp Connect, downloading and displaying data. Once we've logged some data for a period of time, with our data logger, we're going to want to offload or download that data using our smartphone or tablet. And because we're using Intemp Connect, we will also be pushing that data up to the cloud um, into IntempConnect.com. Again, your smartphone or tablet will do that for you. So we want to log into the app on our smartphone or our tablet. Again, make sure we have I am an Intemp Connect user. Make sure that our login credentials, our username or email address, and our password match what we used in our Intemp Connect account. Once we log in, we will see all of the data loggers that are currently within range of that smartphone or tablet. Here is our data logger. It's called Intemp Connect. It's been logging for a period of time. We're going to tap on that to connect to it. And we can see we're now connected to it and we want to select download from the actions menu and we're going to download that data it's going to download it to the smartphone or the tablet it's going to create a report which we can share locally from our tablet or smartphone and it's also going to push that data to Intemp Connect. We have three choices for downloading we can download and continue logging we can download and restart the data logger, which will begin it logging new data over the old data, so the old data will be overwritten and erased. Or we can say download and stop. We would use that if we wanted to change the configuration in the data logger to something different. And again, the logger advertising to us so we can communicate to it with our smartphone or tablet, and then we, we can push that data up to Intemp Connect if we have Wi-Fi or cellular communications with that tablet or smartphone. Keep in mind that the tablet or smartphone is the integral part of getting this interconnectivity uh, to work between the data logger and the Intemp Connect uh, account in the cloud. So now we're going to switch to our computer and we're going to go into our browser and type in IntempConnect.com and log into our Intemp Connect account. And here we can see, here's our Intemp Connect account and we can see at the bottom of the screen, um, here's our deployment and our data. Uh, you can see the configuration date, when the logger was stopped, when it was started, when it was downloaded. And if we click on the configuration name here, we'll go to the data display page. Here's our graphical data. The pink information, the, the pink shading indicates a high alarm. Blue shading indicates the low alarm threshold. And we have all our other information, our serial number, our logger pass key, which we're going to talk, in a, talk about in a subsequent uh, video. And also all the statistical information, uh, the average mean, the standard deviation, min-max, things like that.